Hi, welcome, Simon here and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to walk you through step by step on how to add additional RAM to your ASUS TUF F15 gaming laptop. Alright, so here is the uh, DDR4 laptop RAM and it's 8 gigabytes. I'll be adding towards the laptop and try to increase up to 16 gigabytes. You can definitely go up to 32 or 64 gigs if you have the uh, the right amount of RAM. And let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I like to do is identify the laptop. Again, this is the ASUS gaming laptop F15 or the model which is the FX506L. Next step is to get yourself a Phillips screwdriver. I'll be using a electronic screwdriver here and I'll be removing the screws the screws in the center on the top center are a lot longer compared to the screw on the top left or the top right so make sure you do not mix match the screw as you can see that the other two in the center are longer the one on the left and right is a lot shorter alright so make sure you do not mix match the screws The bottom left corner, this screw right here is a lot shorter, that is the shortest screw. The bottom in the center is the same as the rest. And the bottom right corner, this screw right here, did it does not come off. Okay, you can keep unscrewing, it doesn't come off. It's gonna be like this. The reason why, because the bottom right corner screw, it pushes the back cover, okay? It gives you enough room to stick a plastic prying tool in between that gap so that you can pry open your laptop. So you just remove the back cover straight up and now you can see the internal part of your laptop. Original RAM, it comes with 8GB. It is already pre-installed in the first slot. To remove that original RAM, all you have to do is to push these two metal bracket away from each other so it opens up that little clipper. When you push it away and you can see the RAM it's loose and it pop open at 45 degree angle and you can just slide it off just like that so this is the RAM slot for the first and here comes the second slot for the bottom so this laptop here has two slots where you can add 8 and 8 which is 16 or you can do 16 and 16 which is the 32 gigs of RAM I'm not 100% sure if you can go with 32 and 32 up to 64 so if you know the answer please comment below I would pin it down and let everybody know that you are actually helping in this channel um, by educating if the laptop can go up to 64 gigabytes of RAM all right again this is the original DDR4 RAM I'll be installing back together so make sure you slide it in at 45 degree angle and then when you push it down you can hear that the clipper will just click in and lock on its own all right this is the additional ram 8 gigabytes i'll be adding 8 and 8 up to 16 of gigs if you notice that the ram here has a little gap and that gap is to align together with the slot so you slide it in at 45 degree angle and then you just press it down right in the center and let the clipper clip it down on its own. 
all right that's pretty much it the next step is to have the uh, back cover going back together so I like to uh, close it tight let the clicker to click all the way back in all right just like such just click it in like so and then press it down on the rest of the corner the two longer screws going back to the top center all right so if you're not sure where to buy that um, ram please check my description down below i would link it where you can um, go directly to amazon for this uh, ram okay yeah so if you're not sure where to buy the correct ram for the upgrade in your asus laptop check out the link down description below i will direct you to amazon where you can buy directly from them uh, it's going to be a ddr4 laptop ram and that's all you need as well as the phillips screwdriver um, if you're not sure where to buy the tools from uh, go check it out the link down description below okay and again if you do find that this video is helpful all i like to do is ask you to click the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't um, i just hope that by doing so it's going to motivate me and make more of this kind of video for you um, so all right thanks for watching i hope that uh, you learned something today and until next time bye now